What's up everybody, Nick Slizzler here, and today I am going to be doing a requested video that was requested yesterday during the update video. Uh, it's a board setup video. Um, so one of the viewers, I believe it was a Little Uzi, um, asked me how I set, or to do a setup video for my skateboard. So I figured I would do one real quick. Now, the last time you guys saw me skate in my vlog, I was skating this board. This board broke, if you guys can't see that, it snapped. Um, so I got a new board when I was down in Chicago, and it's right here, and I'm gonna show it to you guys real quick. Now, if you guys hear my fan in the background, it's because it's like 192 degrees here. Not really, but you know, you know what I mean. So uh, we went to Zoomies when we were in Chicago, and I picked up this deck. It's an ATM, which is the Zoomies house brand. Um, Pretty good deck. Uh, I do have a couple complaints about it. First off, how easily it scratches. Like, um, if you guys get a good brand, like Baker or back there behind the Baker, there's a blind. The paint doesn't scratch so much as it smears. But this paint kind of just, like, scratches right off, and I don't really like that in a board. But, um, you know, it's, it's whatever. And then we have the Mob 180 Grip Tape. Uh, it's super grippy, uh, good for flip tricks and stuff like that. Uh, I think I have Iron Horse hardware. I'm pretty sure Iron Horse Phillips hardware. Uh, and then Spitfire 52mm wheels and Bones Red's bearings because those are the best bearings. Not really, but they're good. They're very dependent. So um, you can depend on them really well to get the job done. And then I have a pair of really old independent trucks that I've been using for a while. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's basically it. I mean, um, like I said, the board itself is, it's got a beautiful graphic. It skates pretty well. It's got a good concave to it, if you can't tell right there. Uh, good concave, mellow kick. It, it's a good board. I, I like mellow kick on my boards because, uh, when I kick, I kick strong. So I don't want my foot catching and doing like a quad flip on accident. So... I prefer to have a mellow kick, but um, the concave is perfect for me too. Like I said, the only complaint is how quickly that paint scratches, which, you know, it's whatever. It's a skateboard, so it's meant to be dinged up. But uh, yeah, so it's all, all around a really good setup. Uh, I'll show you guys a couple more boards that I had that were really good. Um, but for the most part, except for my blind and my blank deck, I used the independent trucks with the uh, with the Bones Reds, the uh, Spitfires. This board, I used the Spitfires on. No, I didn't use um, Spitfire. I used, I don't even know what kind of wheels they were. They were like this big. They were tiny. But uh, I used a different kind of wheel for this board. And I think I used the same trucks. But this was my first board when I got back into skateboarding. Like, I quit for a while, and then I got back into it. So this was the first board I used after I got back into it. Uh, Blind is one of my favorite brands, aside from Enjoy. So um, this board was awesome. I loved it. I love the graphic. I love everything about it. That's why it's hanging up right here. And then the blank deck, which, as you can tell, I had a lot of people draw all over it. But that's only half of it. The other half is up here. That board was also pretty good. Uh, I definitely enjoyed using it. Um, that was the first board I landed a kickflip on when I started again. Uh, but before then, I used... It was... Before the... Before the blank deck, I used my blind. Before the baker, I used this blind, which is broken. Um, this blind... I actually got before I got this baker, and then when I got the baker, I gave the blind to Dilnai, and as soon as that baker snapped, he gave me this blind back, which then snapped. So yeah, I have a collection of broken skateboards just laying around my house that I plan on, I plan on eventually hanging them all up, but for now, you know, I'm just hanging the ones that I actually really like up. But, uh, yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys. There should be a live stream tonight. Um, it'll probably be a gaming live stream, but it'll probably still be a live stream. All right, so you guys just saw the first sucky part of recording with an iPhone. Uh, I ran out of storage, so I have to 
redo my outro. Um, so basically, guys, what I was saying in the outro, uh, I'm going to live stream tonight, probably. I hope to see you guys there if I do. Um, and it's going to be pretty awesome if we do live stream. It's going to be a game that you guys are going to enjoy. So, um, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will start editing the Chicago vlogs hopefully today or tomorrow, so they should be up by next week at the latest. So, yeah, you guys are going to see them a little bit late. Like, they're going to be a little outdated, but, you know, it's 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 whatever. We'll at least be able to... I'll at least be able to show them to you guys. So, um... <laughs> My door just flung open. But, uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace!